welcome back to my channel. It is Ashley here again. Hope you guys are having a fantastic, wonderful day. I'm doing really good today. It's really dreary outside. It snowed earlier, so it's really cold out also. But again, I hope you guys are doing well. In today's video, we have another unbagging unboxing for you guys today. Today we have my Ipsy. If you guys don't know, Ipsy is $10 a month, comes every single month, and I will leave their link down below so you guys can have easy access to it and no way an affiliate link. So let's just get in here and see what we got. Okay. So we pull it out of the bag and this is what the bag this month looks like. It is like a purple blue color and has all these little hearts around it, which I think is super cute. Pull out the cards for the month. And it just says, happy Friendsgiving. Say what you're thankful for in five emojis and go. Okay, so getting into the actual product, the first thing I'm pulling out is this. This is by Tarte, um, Amazonian Clay 12 Hour Blush, which I absolutely, absolutely love Tarte blushes. I have quite a few of them. This one is in the shade Quirky. So we'll get this out of its little box. <laughs> that like flew out at me. So here is what the packaging looks like. It just says Tarte on the front of it and on the back it just says Quirky. Okay. If you guys see me like blinking a whole bunch, I tried to put fake lashes on for this video. Did not work at all. So I have lash glue like up here and my eyelid keeps sticking up here and it's really annoying. I tried to scrub my eye really hard with makeup wipe and that didn't work. So if you guys see me blink a whole bunch, I'm okay. It's just that I can't put on fake lashes. So, and I still have my sunglasses on. I'm a mess today. Anyways, back to the blush, and this is in the shade Quirky. And here is the color of the blush. It is very pretty. I love their Amazonian clay. Here is the color of the blush there. And I'll swatch it right there for you guys. So there is the color of the blush. It is very pretty. It's not too, too pink. So I would definitely be using this. The next thing I'm pulling out is this, and this is the Bye Bye Frizz Silicone Free Protecting Leave-In Conditioner. Free from sulfates, SLS, parabens, and something else. This is salon cre created. And here is the packaging for this Bye Bye Frizz, which my hair is a mess like always. So I just want to smell this and see what it smells like. This have a little safety seal on it. So open this up. Oh, it smells good. Ooh, that was kind of a lot. But it is just a white cream and it smells really good. It smells like those like expensive shampoos. I know I'm putting like leave-in conditioner as like hand cream, but I had no else to put it. But it smells really good. It smells like a very expensive shampoo. So I will definitely be using this and see if I can tame my hair somehow. The next thing I'm pulling out is this itty bitty little tube. And this is Bonnie, Bonnie Do Manizer. Manizer? Manizer? I probably completely said all of this wrong. This is a liquid Bonnie Lou Manizer. It's a liquid highlighter and all over illuminator. And this is from The Balm. Okay, so this is from my bom The Balm and it is a liquid highlighter. I completely butchered the name, but here's what the applicator looks like. It is just a standard applicator, and we'll put it on the back of my hand. It is very pretty. Um, I don't. I think this would be too dark for my skin tone, but I could maybe use it like as an eyeshadow or to accentuate accentuate my collarbones. But won't be able. Won't be seeing my collarbones anytime soon because it's freezing outside. But here is the highlighter. It is super pretty. Very pigmented. So I think that is absolutely gorgeous. So there's that little highlighter. The next thing I'm pulling out is this, and this is uh, Make Lip Gloss. And it is in the shade Victoria, it's so tiny. Victoria Plum. Yeah, Victoria Plum. And here is the little lip gloss here. And I do have some lipstick on, so I'm not gonna put it on for you guys this time. And the dough is actually weird. It's like fat, and then it gets skinny, and then fat again, so it's kind of weird shaped. So here is the applicator. I haven't seen anything like that before. 
and I'll get it is a little sticky putting it on my hands so I don't know if it'd be sticky on the lips as well or how it dries down but it is a lip gloss so I don't think it's going to dry down that so there is the lip gloss like I said it is a very, it is pretty sticky when I put it on my hand but it is very pretty so I'll give this a go and the last thing we have is wrapped in some bubble wrap which I love me some bubble wrap so I'll get this guy out and this is a nail polish by Nails Inc. London. And this is in the shade, does it say Montpelier Walk? Montpelier Walk. Mont something of that sort. And here's the nail polish. It is just a nice nude pinky color, which I typically go for darker nails. But as you can see, my nails look terrifying right now because they be painted. But I always love getting nail polishes, so I would definitely be using this also. So that is all we got in our November Ipsy bag. And if you guys get Ipsy, what did you guys get? I would vote. I would love to know everything that you guys got down in the comments, along with, you know, did you guys like it? Did you hate it? Did you, what are all your thoughts about it? I would love to know down in the comments, and I love interacting with you guys. So that is all that I have for this video. If you guys like this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe down below and hit the little bell notification so you get notified every time that I upload. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.